everybody, it's Jace with Marshall Made Collectibles, and today I have a special review. Uh, don't want to call this really an unboxing, it's more of an unbagging, but if you saw my recent uh, um, hint review, which was of the Kai X11 Explorer set, which is a Nathan Drake Uncharted 4 figure set, or... Um, outfit set and all you have to do is add the body and that's exactly what this is this just came in today so what we're going to do is we're going to unbag this and i did get the uh world box uh at 016 body for it which is almost like a uh, hot toys muscular body not the super muscular body but i love world box bodies they're very very dense um, and uh, I even mentioned that in the last video when I showcased the catalog pictures of this. I had talked about this body. Uh, and actually, I picked up a few of these. They're like $31. Um, I, I love World Boxes stuff, so they're, they're a great go-to body. Anyway, let's go ahead and unbag this and take a look at everything we get in this kit. Um, I recently did the uh, CC Toys... Uh, Nathan Drake as well. And actually, there's a couple things from that set I am probably going to pirate and add to this one, which includes the flashlight and the little climbing spike and the, uh, I believe it's like his little pouch for the back. Anyway, let's take a look at what we get here. Uh, first thing we'll go to is the holster, which is, it's done in a pleatherish kind of material got some really nice metal buckles there it's a lot thicker than the one that we got with the cc toys and i like that the little pouches for the the clips are magnetic really made nicely got some real metal rivets there Has a nice thickness to it, really. If um, if you watch my one I did on the CC Toys, it's very, very thin. And honestly, I want to say this is... Hang on, let me get that. This might actually be real leather. Very nice, very nice. Um, we'll do the boots. And what I'll do is I'll unbox and show all this. I'm saving the head sculpt for last because that's what I'm most excited to see. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, I can already tell the boots have got some nice painted weathering detail on them. Let's see, like the... Yeah, a, a tremendous amount of weathering detail on it look really good and these are pegged style boots if you can see down in there they will just pop on very nicely done gorgeous detail and let's see and then we have the pants and the shirts uh, there's the gun his pistol and his clips and at first, I didn't even think he was going to come with the holster and the gun. And later, they added that to the uh, set. Wow, the pistol is nicely detailed. And it does slide. The hammer does move. And let's see if I can get it to stay focused. Eh? And even though you have the two extra clips, there is a clip already in the gun. And then you have the two extra clips. Very nice. You get his blue Henley. It's really nice sweat stain around the collar. You even get some darker, darker gradient color towards the end of the sleeve and at the uh, bottom of the waist of the shirt.
and that continues on throughout the shirt on the back side as well. We get his pants. Now see that's that's crazy. I uh, I think this is for like uh in the game he has a grappling hook with a rope. And it's almost like he comes with that would be like the perfect place to put it. But he doesn't come with it with a set. Now I will probably pirate that off of the uh the CC Toys version. Man, the pants are heavily weathered. It definitely looks like you know he's been in some crap. Just gorgeous. And these are more true to color to in-game color than the CC Toys version as well. Okay, and the reason we are all here is that... Oh, well, wait a second. What do we got here? Oh, we have extra little buttons. I think they match. They match the, for the holster, and they even match, like, the rivets in the pants. So, if you lost any of those, then you'd be good to go. And it is bagged, and it has tissue over it. Are we ready? Drum roll, please. Nathan Drake. Oh my god. <laughs> that looks so good. That is just wild. That looks amazing. And I have uh, extra head sculpts. And what I am going to do is I am replacing that crappy one that we got with our sideshow figure. I love the fact that he's looking off to the left. It definitely gives more character to the piece. He just, he has that look on his face, like, you know, like, oh crap kind of deal. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and put this all together on my AT-016 World Box body. And I will be right back and we'll show you what you get with your uh, Kai X-11 Explorer's kit. Okay, and we're back, and I've got uh, our Nathan Drake all set up. And um, you know how sometimes you look at stuff that's production photos, and the production photos always look a lot better than the final product? This guy looks exactly like the production photos. He is absolutely amazing. The tailoring on the clothes on this set is phenomenal. The head sculpt is absolutely gorgeous. The skin tone on the head works perfectly with this world box body i could not be happier of how it looks they look like they were made for each other um the clothes are really nicely tailored uh no problems whatsoever i did have to heat up the boots a little bit to get them on the ankle pegs but that was about it um i probably need to do a little more futzing to get everything just laying just right but uh i love this set um when you figure that the kit itself cost, I think it was like 80, 85, somewhere in there. Uh, and then you pair that with a $30 body, you're looking at $115 for a Nathan Drake figure, which is second to none. Um, as much as I like the, the CC Toys version, um, it pales in comparison to this. This is just absolutely stunning. 
what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to deck him out with a couple extra things, probably from the CC Toys set, and I will do some HD photos here at the end, so I hope you hang back to see those, and we'll have some close-up shots. Um, I can't highly recommend this enough. Um, I know when 1.6 Kit or uh, people like uh, Kayx11 put out these sets, they are not going to be around for long, and I guarantee you I'll be getting comments two years after this video goes up, like, oh, where do, can I get one? And they will be gone. Uh, so if you're in the market and you would love to have a true Nathan Drake figure that looks absolutely stunning, I wouldn't sit on the fence on this one, guys. I would go ahead and grab him while you can. Uh, if you're new to our channel, please go ahead and hit that like and subscribe so you can see all of our stuff as it comes out and you won't be late to the boat when something like this comes out, uh, something that's this amazing. Uh, if you've been with us, thank you for watching. I really appreciate you being here and hang back for those HD photos. And again, this is Jace for Marshall Made Collectibles. Thank you for watching and take care.